Here are two easy ways to remove iOS 26 beta from your iPhone and restore the latest public iOS version to your iPhone without losing data. The first way is using recovery mode. Use a Mac or PC to backup and restore your iPhone to the latest final public iOS version. Open Finder on your Mac and connect your iPhone to your Mac. Windows users can use the latest version of iTunes to perform the same restore process. Connect your iPhone via USB cable to Mac or PC. Now, unlock your iPhone and allow permission to trust on your device with the lock screen passcode on the iPhone screen. Now, click on your iPhone name showing in the Finder window on the left side. If it's not showing, click on Finder from the top menu. Click on Settings and select CDs, DVDs, and iOS devices. To see a connected iOS device in the Finder window, under the Backup section, select Backup all of the data on your iPhone to this Mac and click the Backup Now option. Wait for Backup Complete. Are you ready to restore the latest final public version in recovery mode? Keep your iPhone connected to your Mac. Your Mac has enough storage, with at least 10 GB of free space. Now, quickly press and release the volume up button, then quickly press and release the volume down button, then only press and hold the power button until you see the recovery screen appear on the iPhone screen. At the same time, your Finder and iTunes pop up with a message that your iPhone is in recovery mode. Now, click on the Restore option and again confirm with the Restore and Update option. During this process, your iPhone will be reset to factory default. Follow the on-screen instructions. Unfortunately, you cannot restore the latest version of iOS 26 beta backup for now in iOS 18. You should wait until you receive iOS 26 public version to your iPhone. Until then, you can restore iOS 18 backup if you have. Method 2 is to wait for the new iOS 26 public version to be available. Until you stop receiving the new iOS 26 beta version update from your iPhone settings. Launch the settings app on your iPhone. Scroll to general options. Tap on Software Update and tap on Beta Updates. Now, select Off. That's it. Go back and save the changes. Now you won't receive a new beta update for your iPhone. And wait for the final public iOS 26 to be available. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. Please post your question in the comment box. Also, remember to like, share, and subscribe for new video updates.